with Chris Foy, driver of Radioactive and member of Team Slinger. Chris, what can you tell us about the track? You said you've been out looking at it, and um, you were telling me that they know what they're doing down here in Florida with building tracks. So can you tell me some of the difference maybe between the mud track we saw in Rush and what we're going to see out here today? The track looks sick. I mean, it's awesome. Anytime you ever come to Florida, they know what they're doing. And uh, not knocking Rush or anything, but that was their first time. Um, you're going to see a lot of high-flying trucks, and we can hit these a lot of these jumps wide open. And uh, this, the transition in the jump, the longness, it should be, you know, as long as your truck or longer. That way you hit it just perfect coming down the downside. Um, I think it's going to be a fast track and ready to put a show on for everybody. We're going to have a good time. It looks like a lot of fun. I mean, I kind of want to go drive around it. And so, go ahead. <laughs> I'm going to hold you to that. Um, so I noticed you've got a cast on your arm. Uh, you think that's going to affect anything today for you? Or? It's, yeah, I, I'm, I'm working with it right now. I drove in, in, with, in Rush and then at Dennis's last weekend, two weekends ago, um, I still have a broke arm. Uh, I broke it in three spots, compound fracture, and uh, it's not healing well. <laughs> it's still got a gap, and i got a plate in there. And uh, I think we're going to have to do surgery again here in the next couple weeks. So. Well, we're glad you're still out here today. I mean, like, priorities, right? The things we do for our sport. One arm, one arm. <laughs> if it won't for... Team Slinger and, her, and Ashley, you know, I probably wouldn't even came all the way down here. So. Well, we appreciate it. We're glad to see you out here. I just rode a track with Trotter, and uh, I wouldn't ride it with anybody else to tell me what to do. The guy's awesome, man. He trucks by Trotter. He, he built the truck and everything, and uh, I wouldn't drive anything else. That's awesome to have the um, camaraderie where you guys can give each other tips and help out, you know. That's right. I mean, home is good, don't get me wrong, but, uh, you know, just – his influence on me these last like six, seven months when I got the truck and he built it for me and everything. And then when I go home and race, I'm like, I'm looking for him. I'm getting ready to take a video and send it to him. But then you got Jimmy and everybody else, man. It's just awesome. There's a camaraderie about this sport. A lot of people don't realize, you know, anybody can go to a bar and meet a friend and everything, but we come together. Shit. I'm 14 hours. You know, we got a guy from here from Illinois. I mean, we talk to each other on the phone, everything, man. It's just, it's the style of the sport and people don't realize it, man. It's, there's more to it than just a mud bog and drinking and right. the bad stuff they see. I mean, they don't see this back here, everybody helping each other. I mean, look around, everybody's doing the RIs. I mean, where else can you go do that, you know? Right. Well, good luck out there today. Thanks so much. We appreciate your time.
Come on! Final split! Final split! In the water! 